14 months ago, the place that I'm sitting now was sand. It was inert, dead Florida sand. And I say dead because most of this sand came from an average of 10 feet underground. And how is that? Well, we dug a four acre pond in order to raise this land up out of the wetland. All of this material that is the foundation of this food forest was underground and there was virtually no life in it. In 14 months, we've done what many, many people told me was impossible. And here's what we've done. We've followed the permaculture principles. We've layered the mulch and the soil and the compost tea and the humigenics and the analemma water and the electroculture and the plants. And when you layer in using these proven principles, layers of life, free energy is all around us. The sun and the soil and the plants work together to create an abundance of energy. <laughs> it's divine, literally. And this is a fun one. So the other day I'm walking through a part of our food forest and we've got a cattle pasture. And the cattle were looking over the fence and they saw all of our sweet potatoes growing along the Centropic rows. And they're like, through this cattle pasture, I wanna go eat some sweet potato leaves. So the cattle came, they had to walk around into the lake, chest deep, and walk around the fence to come into our food forest. And they started eating and pulling out the sweet potatoes. So now we're walking through the sweet potato lanes and the cattle have done all of the harvesting for us. The narrative and the agenda that we see all over the mainstream media is a lie. See the seed right here? This one seed within three or four years can produce one million fruits. 